What are you talking about? I've been waiting for it like a long line. You search the world and you won't find a nigga like me with a swagger like mine. A brother so free and a nigga so fly. I'ma give you my heart, I'ma give you my time, and I promise always. Yo, it's your boy Tyrell. As you guys see, we back in the kitchen, man. Back in the lab with another review. Shout out to my boy Roland, man. But here we got a special review, man. I had a lot of people hit me up. They was like, yo, I love seafood. Is there any way that you can review some of this vegan seafood out there? And I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and do it. You know what I'm saying? Because I used to eat seafood all the time. I used to eat shrimp. I used to eat fish from here, you know, from time to time. Crab legs, no crab legs, things like that. Shrimp scampi, if I want to keep getting into it. If I didn't choose the vegan route, I probably went pescatarian. So I thought it'd be pretty cool to go ahead and try this stuff out. Crabless cakes. These are like crab cakes pretty much, but you know, obviously no crab. Fishless filet. It's like little little fish things, man. I used to eat stuff like this when I was a kid, man. The crab cakes I used to eat a lot, and I used to eat this. My mom is really huge on seafood. My family loves seafood, so I used to eat stuff like this all the time. And to top it all off, I decided to go ahead and buy some uh, vegan tartar sauce. In the past, Gardein has had some pretty good products, I'm not gonna lie. Almost every product Gardein had, I pretty much like. This right here, I'm not sure if it's gonna be good, I'm not sure if it's gonna be bad, but I'll give you guys my honest, raw review on it. You back at the Iron Man stove, man. Iron Man stove, man. Hey, Robert Downey, Robert Downey Jr., hey, man. You got nothing on this, this oven right here, the stove top. The DHA algae oil, I believe that's what gives it like that, that fishy smell, you know what I'm saying? So. Off rip, it doesn't smell that bad. I'm not even gonna lie to you, dog. Like, off a of smell alone, bro. Mmm. Right here, that's like an eight off a of smell, bro. Oh, yeah, man, hold on. You got the, the black soup bottom. What are you talking about? With the TF on there, man. Hey, y'all, go get you some. Black Friday's coming up. We got some sales coming. You guys go ahead. Hey, follow me on Instagram so you'll be the first ones to know about the sales, man. But this is a soup bottom, man. You know what I'm saying? We got in two colors right now. We got the black and we got the olive green. We also got some hoodies coming soon too, so y'all stay tuned for that. Anyway, we're gonna go ahead and start with some vegetable oil. Go ahead and just drop it in. Oh shit. <coughs> Might put too much, man. It's been a long time, man. And it says it takes about 15 minutes or so to cook. Seven to nine minutes on each side or to golden brown and crispy. Roland said he's not a big fan of seafood, so I don't know if he's gonna try it out, but more for me. If it's good. I'm gonna go ahead and let this cook up. Flip it over in about seven minutes or so. And uh, right now we're gonna go ahead and work on the fishless fillets. Pop these in the oven for about 15 minutes. Y'all stay tuned. Gotta go green, my brothers is vegan. Leaves keep on changing, that's just the season. Fighting to live as long as I'm breathing. Family need me, I got my reason. Blessed with tears, believe me I'm bleeding. Don't think no more, I go on the field and money was slow. Patience was reeling, but we was working while y'all was sleeping. Yeah, but I'm only gonna go if my heart go. Treat my whole life like an art show. Gotta go straight to the crossroad. And my brothers came with me by the car. Looking all nice. Looking all lovely. All right, so we got the crabless cakes and we got the fishless filet. And we got some tartar sauce too, man. I actually uh, haven't had this tartar sauce before. I figured, you know, when people get you know, seafood, they want some tartar sauce. So I'm going to give a review of that as well. What I'm going to do is I'm going to try it by itself. Then I'm going to try it with tartar sauce and I love ketchup too. So crab cakes, pretty crispy. As you see, man, I got that stuff all up in there. Just, all right. You see there's a bunch of, bunch of stuff up in there, man. Seven and a half, maybe eight out of 10, probably seven and a half with nothing. I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try this tartar sauce by itself too first though. So I don't know if I'm gonna like this. Try a little bit. It's like an exquisite taste. It's not bad, but it just hit me different. I, I didn't expect it to taste like this. Try it with the tartar sauce and see what happens. Right. Tartar sauce brings it up from a seven to like an eight and a half. 
There's peanut butter, there's jelly, <laughs> there's Kool-Aid, there's sugar. There's these crabless cakes and this tartar sauce. You know what I'm saying? What I'm trying to say is they complement each other pretty good. Now, when I go out, out of my way, me personally, to buy this all the time, probably not. You know what I'm saying? But for you people out there that like seafood, looking for a vegan seafood alternative, that's pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. I'll probably give it like eight and a half out of 10. With the tartar sauce. Without it, like a seven out of 10. Now we're gonna move on to these uh, fishless fillets. All right, let's break it up and see. It looks interesting, man. It smells pretty good. It smells like, <laughs> I've had these a lot when I was a kid, so I, I can tell you for sure if it's gonna be good or not. It smells pretty good. Wow. Bro, yo. All jokes aside, I promise to God, bro. This should remind me of Captain D's. If you don't know what Captain D's is, think of Lone John Silver. I just went down memory lane, bro. When I took a bite of that, you know what I pictured, man? Me and my mom in her car, going to Captain D's, getting me some of these, getting some hush puppies. I know you remember the hush puppies, man. I know you remember the hush puppies. And this took me down memory lane, which means this is damn good. Cause I can, I can it just triggered a memory in my, in my, in my brain, man. That's good. Like Ratatouille. Ratatouille, man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Let's check out this Oh, yeah. Do right back. Yo. Oh, my goodness, bro. Me, personally, bro. 9 out of 10. I'm going to get these 9 out of 10. It took me down memory lane, bro. You know how good something got to be to take you to a specific memory, bro? Captain D's, Long John Silver, Hush Puppies, French Fry. These are pretty good. If you're a hardcore, you know, seafood person who loves seafood, can't go a day without seafood, you'll probably be able to taste a little bit of the difference, especially in these crab crabless cakes. If you're asking me which one I like better, definitely the fishless fillets. These aren't bad either if you pair it with some tartar sauce. If you had this before, go ahead and comment down below. Let me know what you guys think. And also, man, I'm gonna go ahead and try this too. Let me get another review, man. It has nothing to do with this. Roland actually uh, gave this to me, man. It's a non-dairy, how you say that? Chobani? Chobani. Chobani. Hold on, let me focus on that. That'll focus. Non-dairy Chobani strawberry yogurt. Coconut base. Honest review. Damn, that smells pretty damn good, man. It's like banana strawberry, I feel like. All right, here we go. And it's like more of a drink, man. It's not even like, you know, it's not like yogurty. if that makes sense. I think I gotta shake it off some more. I'm not getting all the flavor. Let me see, man. Try to shake it off some more. Maybe, maybe, maybe the flavor is stuck at the bottom of it. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I ain't really messing with this too much. This is like the first review that I, I did. Yeah, man. You don't get too much. It's supposed to, look. It's supposed to be strawberry flavor, bro. You don't really taste the strawberry. It says a coconut it? base. I've never tried it. Yeah, man. Like, I'm gonna let Roll try it, man. Oh, bro. It smells good, though. It smells good. It smells good. It's like watered down, kind of. Yeah. Yeah, right. Weird. It's like weird because it's. I was, I was expecting a lot more. Like a, a bigger punch. Yeah, yeah, more flavor, right? But it's not that much flavor in it, man. Mm -hmm. So, hey, Chobani, if you want to get your flavors right, man, hit me up, hit Roland up, man. We'll get you right and make some sales. You know what I'm saying? This ain't it. This ain't it right now. I'm not even going to give it a rating. Rating, not yet rated. This is a movie that hasn't been rated yet. To be determined. <laughs> to be determined. <laughs> hey, guys, like I said earlier, uh, Black Friday deal coming. Make sure you head over to the website, get you a shirt, support me, support the brand, support the movement. But with all that being said, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe.
that subscribe button. You better hit it too. Also, click the bell so you can get a notification anytime I post. And I will see y'all next video. Bro, these just right here, real good, cool, bro. Like, take it back to, uh, you know. What are you talking about? Bobby in the lead, what are you talking about? Cooking Chef T, what are you talking about? Told me that the beef weren't healthy. So we went green, what are you talking about? What are you talking about?